have six large modern buildings on a 25-acre wooded site on the outskirts of Springfield, Illinois. The school buildings are brick, fireproof structures connected by enclosed heated walkways. But it takes more than a building to make a school. It takes a sound program and a dedicated, loving staff to make Hope School a home away from home for 80 students who range in age from 2 to 18. Our day in the Hope School starts at 7 in the morning. Each cottage operates under a family unit system with a house mother or house father in charge of each group. The first things we stress are the self-help skills, dressing, washing, and toilet training. We want to make the children as independent as possible. Most of the children come to the school without the ability to dress themselves. It might take five or six years before they are able to put on their shoes without help. But patience and repetitive training can do wonders. The children of Hope School go to class every weekday and work from one to five hours a day, depending on their physical and mental ability. Instructors who are certified in different areas of special education plan individualized programs for each child at the beginning of each school year. We use a variety of all kinds of toys and games to develop motor dexterity and muscle coordination. The students also receive training in independent living skills. They are taught how to tell time on a braille clock. They learn how to count money and make change and use the telephone. The high achievers are taught pre-vocational skills, preparing them for the day when they can work in the outside world. Three times a week, the students come to the pool as a part of our physical activities program. Swimming improves muscle tone and helps to sharpen coordination. In 1975, we started a Girl Scout troop in the Hope School. The girls were taught how to cook things like pizza pies, fudge and cookies, and sell them door to door. The profits went to support group activities and buy pins, badges, and uniforms. This lovely old lady is a great grandmother. She and the other volunteers from the Senior Citizens Center in Springfield came here to show the girls how to crochet and knit. The Girl Scout program is a great success. So far, we have earned 17 merit badges, and we expect to win a lot more. One of the biggest social events of the year is the school picnic. The packetful. Huh? Okay. I'd fall down with them in this game, but I don't know whether I could get up. Isn't it marvelous to see these youngsters enjoying? Normal games and fun, even though they're handicapped. Okay. This is a real home where they play, have picnics, ah. enjoy themselves, and learn how to take care of themselves. It's one of the most inspiring sights I've seen anywhere. <laughs>